Well, it's seven o'clock in the morning. I'm getting a little later start than I wanted. I'm heading out to on my first uh, moose hunt ever. Wish it was for a bull, but I've got a moose cow tag, which is a once in a lifetime tag. I've applied for over 30 years for a moose tag and the last two years I figured you know what I want to shoot a moose I want to kill something a little bit bigger with my bow and so I applied for a cow tag that's what I have and I have a friend that's south of town that has a moose that's been coming in where he's got his tree stand set up I don't know if I'm gonna set up in his tree stand or I'm gonna set up in my tree saddle Hopefully I'm gonna set up in my tree cell. That's what I would like to do. I think it'd be, I've never even killed a deer out of my tree cell. I've been hunting for three years out of the tree cell. This would be my third year. But if I could kill a moose out of my tree cell, I'd be, I'd be really, really happy. So I'm excited about this morning. It's seven o'clock in the morning. It's just breaking daylight. Uh, the moose has been coming in in the middle of the day. So I'm gonna go in. He's told me where to go to find it. Hopefully I don't have too much of a struggle finding it. And uh, we'll see what happens. It'd be awesome if I could shoot a moose out of a tree saddle because that'd be quite an accomplishment for me. Shoot the biggest animal I've ever shot and also do it out of a tree saddle. So we'll see what it ends up happening. Oh, nice good bed head I've got there going on too, but I don't think the moose will care.
I shouldn't be shaking this bad. I've never shot anything that big. That was pretty exciting. Pretty exciting. I didn't expect to be. That excited you the most. A gal, I should say. But it's about 30 yards. She came right in and then she acted like she was a little spooky. I couldn't get the other camera on her. I don't know if this camera cut her or not, but she pretty sure she went down about maybe a hundred yards out there and never she never uh, I just saw her disappear into the corner and I never saw any movement or anything so pretty sure I have a dead moose so hopefully the work begins here pretty quick I am super excited I just shot cow moose Right, right about there, about 30 yards. And uh, this is the first thing I have ever shot out of my tree saddle, and I am thrilled. It took me a long time to get up here and get everything set up, but it was worth it. Hopefully, She'll just be laying 100 yards out there, and we can start working on her. I gotta make some phone calls. I'm pretty excited. Guy's gonna be the first one, and it'll probably be Dad and a few other guys. Well, didn't get any pictures with the other camera. Maybe a little bit. Shot my first moose out of. Tree saddle, actually the first thing I've ever shot out of a tree saddle. Moose is standing right there. I measured out there about 30, just outside the shadows, about 30 or 40 yards, so I measured 30 there. She was quartering away. Well, we found the moose. Now we're going in with the trucks to 
start the work. It's going to be fun getting it out of here. Fell in the corn probably 100, 150 yards. And we're going to be cutting it up into pieces and uh, carrying it out a load at a time. 